Hello everyone, today we are going to learn the difference between the submit and the button. I will cover the input, submit and the input button and the different button tag. Hope you guys enjoy it. Let's go. First, there is one very important thing. Inputs are most used in forms. When the button is most used for JavaScript that I will not cover a lot, yes. Then, the input button, it's very close to the button, the normal button. They, are ha they have uh, both very similar features. As an example, uh, the button already has a button. Let me just open something and let's check it. Instead of just hear me talking. So we are going to put something like index.html. In here, let's go with the exclamation mark enter. In here, we are going to put the button. Save it. We go to our browser. This was just some testing I was doing. Okay. So, in here, the button looks like this. When the input type button. Look like this. Pretty different, right? Both can be add a value to it, so you can put whatever you want. The first one is not where oh yes, yes. In the button we don't put the value. You put the name you want. In the middle of the stuff. Here we go. Click button, click input button. None of them do anything. It's obvious, right? In my last video I made a video. Not my last. A few videos ago I made a video about the click function. The on click function of JavaScript. If you want I can cover more a bit the button. But just so you know, if you are just like me, more PHP, more... Uh, not too much in JavaScript. Button is not used for forms. It's used for script. When the submit that I can show you, uh, you first are going to create a form. They are going to send it to the to dot PHP. It will be created. A method will be get. Here we go. Now, we are going to use um, input text, we don't need a level, we are just putting a button submit saying click to go, right? And if you come here, we, just, we, are, we already have a space to the name and a button to click. We can click it, but we do not find it, right? Uh, now we are going to create a 2.php 2.php In the 2.php we are going to start the php And since we have a, have a, a get method, we put this uh, the raw sign, underscore, get uh, Those ones, those uh, strict bra uh, brackets, I think that's the name, uh, single quote, then we put the name, we didn't put yes, in the input type text we need to have a name value, because the name value is what we can call for a form, PHP, for JavaScript it would be an ID, as an example, and uh, in the name I just put the name because it's the name of the person but I can put like good in here if I just come here reload the page of course put banana banana click go we get banana back right and uh, with the input button input submit and the button itself it's everything hope you guys enjoyed that is all 
the little the little video, right? The little video you can check about the JavaScript on click button. And there are lots of PHP, HTML and CSS more. Hope you guys enjoyed and see you soon.